The following KQED production was produced in high definition. Hi, this is Ifanya Bell for Quest TV. I'm here at the Oakland Zoo with Margaret Rouser, who is one of the lead uh, keepers here at the zoo. Uh, and she has a wonderful guest who's sort of been staring at me a bit. Why, why with the staring? Well, this is Olivia, and she is a great horned owl. And as you can see, she's got these large, beautiful eyes because they are nighttime predators. Uh, one of the interesting things about those big eyes is that because they're so big, she literally can't move them back and forth in her skull. There's just not enough space in there for muscles and tendons and all that same stuff that we have. So instead, she has to move her head around, and she can actually move her head 270 degrees. Like that? About, yeah, just like that. It's about four-fifths of the way around. Yeah, my mom could do that when yeah, we were kids. Yeah, a lot of moms can do that. So, Margaret, uh, along with the eyes being so, so unique, I'm also seeing the ears are pretty pronounced. Um, explain, are those some particular kind of adaptation or...? And what you're looking at here is actually feathers, which is how they got their name of the great horned owl. But so they're not ears, not ears? No, no, her ears are actually completely separate in a different spot. And they're very well hidden under those feathers. If you look at the discs of feathers around her eyes, they're right at the edges. Those disc funnels sound into her uh, ears. And then her ears are also asymmetrical. Mm. So one ear is up, kind of up here, and the other ear is kind of down here. And what that does is it helps her to triangulate sound because, of course, she's hunting at night, looking for little mice. And one of the ways that she can find them is by listening and triangulating the sound to find out exactly where that mouse is. This is an owl that people can actually see in their own backyards. So if you're out hiking, walking around, looking up in the trees, and this is where you might see them. Thank you very much, Margaret. Thank you very much, Olivia. Uh, these guys are here seven days a week, 10 to 4. This is Ifanya Bell for Quest Television. Keep Quest free. Discover more and donate at kqed.org quest.